I mean, the part of the Bible that I know the most is Exodus, because I think Moses is a total badass. True. Wow. Okay. He just man threw a stick on the ground oh, and turned to a snake. Yeah, yeah but, it doesn't but get that... cooler than that. No, it it's not. Well, I mean, in terms of mortal accomplishments, I mean, right. that's a magic that wasn't trick right a mortal there. accomplishment. That Moses was more like God. magic. No, he's not magic. It was with the help of God. It was not with the help of God, it was with the authority of God. He didn't do it at all. He just did what God asked him, and God carried it through. So. God being the burning bush. Carp, stop inviting me. Are you in the session? Where does that I've paused right now because my mic wasn't being recorded quite just yet. It will soon though, so I won't have to do this too many times. Anyway, I just wanted to explain what I was saying here. Right now, I asked, I pretty much just asked, hey, what is all this about Moses and a stick? What's, what's this about him throwing a stick into the air? No, it was that at the was ground. From the authority of God, it turned into a snake. Yeah. Well, um, okay, going back to, uh, the LGBT stuff, I heard some people say that you don't, I'm not with um, it, and I'm don't... not against it, you know? Yeah, so, they're, they're yeah, kind of I heard... They're people, so... Yeah, yeah, they're still people, you're still supposed to love them. But you should, you should not at all support anything about them at all. You shouldn't, Why not? you shouldn't love what they do. Because it's against God, it's actually an abomination to God. Um, being, being homosexual, or doing homosexual acts, or transgenderism yeah, and stuff. Yeah, I, I thought it, I thought it was a sin for, uh, It is a sin. You know, a dude to bang another dude and a woman to bang another woman. It is a sin. The Bible makes that clear. I have the verse. If I find, if I find it, I'll, I'll say it to everyone. Yeah. I, I have, I have to like look at my rain. 15 things. There's a few verses on it. Exactly. We just all accept each other for who we are. No, yes. that's not right. It's not the right thing to do. I'll pause this one more time here. I won't have to again because my voice actually starts getting recorded quite soon, thankfully. Anyway, here I just said, I reminded them that it's very important for people to love each other very, very much, especially men. I mean, I'm not gay, but I don't have a problem with it. Well, I mean, I would say you should, yeah, kinda because good. God has an issue with it. I do. He, it's he abhors it. It's an abomination. Not particularly our business. If God has that problem, then that's between God and the gay people. No. Okay, it's here it is. Let God deal with the gay people, and... I say. I found yeah, the verse. Yeah, you're not supposed to be rude to them and stuff. You're still supposed to love them, but you should definitely tell them that what they're doing is wrong, in a loving way, of course. Is that that's not only between God and the gay people. We're us as Christians were made to serve other people, and the Bible is actually made for rebuking, correcting, and training and teaching. It's actually made for that. So mm. we're actually it's a, a command for us gay to people. correct each other. They're pretty nice. It's a command to correct each other in Scripture, and you can't be a Christian and be gay like live in the gay life if you have if you have homosexual like feelings and stuff you know everyone has sin and stuff it sucks but everyone has sin Whoa, but if you, well if it's you, at least what jesus oh. died for so well jesus oh my didn't God. die for gay our people, sins like for, for no all not people well he died for our sins i'm gonna tell you where it's at yeah yeah right i'm sorry i was just 
Uh, it's in Damn. first Cathedrians six nine thirteen. Yeah. Man, if this guy died over the stage for coach. our sings, does that mean Damn. technically he kind of died for our gay sex as well, or? He died for that Our. repentance. If someone oh, turns buddy. away, but go ahead and read the um, read the verse. Oh, I'm not, I'm not being funny or anything. I, it just it just suddenly struck me. Or do you know that the unrighteousness will not inherit the kingdom of God? Do not be deceived, neither the sexual immorality, nor adultery, nor adulterers, nor men who practice homosexual homosexuality, nor revivers, nor thieves. The greed, nor drunkards, nor swinos will inherit the kingdom of God. Yes, sir. And notice how it says Amen. practice. Amen. Amen. It doesn't. Yeah. It doesn't say. I mean, drunkers, truthfully, what's God against, what's you can't. God you can't. The Irish. And I can wow, make that joke okay. because of the Irish. It, I'm allowed the, to make that joke. We're I'm not Irish. even talking about anything about Sorry. Irish. What are you on about? What about the Irish? It was a joke. Something oh, about. Right. <laughs> We don't talk about Irish. stuff yeah. like that, man. Have you ever heard um, that story about a vicar who had a potato up his ass and he said he got it by falling <laughs> onto it? I don't think I have, but it sounds <laughs> yeah. like he was sinning. He went to a okay. doctor's no, 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 or something. No, no, listen, listen, everyone listen. If you're here to troll and not to listen and actually talk on topic, please I'm listening, leave. I'm listening, I'm not here to troll. By no, all I'm, means, no, I'm... please leave. I'm not but really if you interested are here in theology. To listen and you are serious and stuff, then please just just listen and talk and on topic. Don't don't make weird jokes. I swear I'm not. Don't I'm make not. crude jokes. But technically, yeah, but I mean, oh, about the Irish thing. That, that's not, yeah, the Irish thing yeah, is that's weird. Funny. That's but not on topic. Back to the potato. Back to the potato. <laughs> technically, the Bible. The Bible doesn't really say <laughs> anything. <laughs> Don't attack Not putting a potato up your ass, does it? Hello. And I never mentioned a potato. That, but that's but... not humane to do. Who would? How would you fit a potato up your ass? Like I mean, have you not seen one guy? There are ways. Uh, your asshole can stretch up uh, eight, eight inches wide. And, uh, oh my god, yeah, I read something about that. Yeah, are we gonna stay on topic, or are we gonna you talk You can fit about like six raccoons up your, your asshole. Yeah, that's insane. <laughs> That Sounds like a sin to me. Which you should not be doing. Okay, not mentioned in the Bible, you know. No, no, no. J just listen. I'm, I'm actually being serious because I'm gonna start kicking people because you guys are playing. I'm, I'm so serious right now. Please, if you're here to troll or if you want to talk about this, go into your own party. That's I, not what this is for. I, I'll behave. That, that's literally not what it's for. I'm not trying to be brutal. Would you please Apologies. have respect and not say foul language? For the Bible yeah. says foul language is not permitted to, to leave your mouth. It is a exactly. sin. Because who who said foul That's language? A it's a it's a sin to have crude joking as well, meaning joking that that isn't um isn't ah, my bad isn't isn't good like isn't Ryan, um, is right camp? to joke about. Okay, so to fine. make to we... make jokes about oh well oh, wait, the Bible doesn't mind. technically say that. That's not right, and that's crude joking, and it's it's not it's not good in God's eyes. So can we not do things like that? All right, all right. You're right. Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry. And also, can we try to not swear? I understand that it becomes a habit. I used to have a, a, a swearing habit, but it is or a sin to swear. Bit. It is a sin. Uh. So I'd encourage you guys to at least try to um, lower down how much you swear and be mindful that it is a sin. I do have some uh, bad yeah, habits. I get that. Take yeah. a picture with the dog. Go next to him, man. Yeah, that, that's you totally swore. fine. It's just, just be mindful. Because a lot of, uh, the majority of the people, when I tell them that oh. it is a sin to swear, they've never even heard of that before. They thought that it was okay as long as you don't say God's name in vain. Photo. But it, but it is, it is <laughs> a sin up. to swear, to curse, to cuss, whatever you want to call well, it. I got a it deer. is a sin. So. Alright. I'm just letting you guys know. Please stay on topic. No crude joking. Alright. Oh yes, ma'am. This is my friend. Uh, Why don't you... Buford. um? Do not touch Buford. I I'm not being funny or anything, but like... Why don't you try to sort of steer it more into a more productive uh, uh, direction? Oh, will you watch it? 
Jesus, you fit by my tent. You fit oh, I'm trying to be productive. It's just that I mean, oh, not being funny, we're eh? talking about the wrongness of man. homosexuality, hey. and then somehow ah. it got on to no, 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 anal play, which isn't what He's we were fragile. talking about. Ah, uh, yeah, my bad. Oh, throw him. You fit. Are you okay? It's just not. Hold on, let me take this off to see if he's alive. Yeah, 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 you gotta take off his skin so he'll be alive. And it, and oh, oh, where, where does the Bible stand? We're trying to keep this deer alive. On other Whoever sort of eating the chips like that. Could, could someone really stop like eating movie. the chips, please? Oh, sorry, I'm putting it somewhere. Um, that's all right. All right, it's Buford's it's safe. Damn, hey, bro. Where's my? Where does? Who's asking? Buford, what? She's just hungry, guys. guys. Catch. Where do you think the Bible stands on trans people? Um, I can tell you that in a few seconds. Look, give me a second. Alright. There's plenty more where that came from. If you want to see the rest of it, make sure to press on part 2 in the end screen coming up.